over the center of a 10 million strong metropolis. South Korea ranked 173rd out of 180 countries in terms of air quality in a recent study by Yale University. But this year's Environmental Performance Index underlines the fact it is a global problem, saying more than 3.5 billion people, half of the world's population, live in nations with unsafe air quality. As more than one scientist on board told me, at least South Korea is acknowledging there's a problem and opening up its airspace to NASA and its expertise. Paula Hancock, CNN, on board NASA's DC-8 research jet over South Korea. We're not going to run away without a look at, let's call it, lighthearted news. Or in this case, light-footed. Check it out, y'all. A moose on the lip. Don't you get it? We don't need you anymore. 